Meet Braden Emmanuel Taylor, better known as NATO, as in tornado. It's the perfect nickname for a baby who arrived on the day when an EF5 tornado tore through Moore, Oklahoma, and the medical center where his mother Shayla was giving birth. We knew that the weather was, you know, potentially going to get bad that day, and my doctor actually wanted to send me home, but she couldn't because when I got there, I was already in labor. As the tornado approached, nurses rushed the bedridden Shayla to a windowless operating room and prepared for its fury. So we got all the blankets and pillows and everything else out of the blanket warmer we could. And they laid them around me and, you know, covered my head and all of my body. And we were down and holding on to each other with our bodies kind of over her. We were just kind of um, hunkering down together and praying pretty loudly. Lord, please let us be okay. Let us make it through this. The medical center took a direct hit. The uh, door blew open and the wall across the room from us blew out. I felt like there was a good possibility that we could be pulled out with the, with the wind. All I could see was a hole in the wall where I could see the interstate and the movie theater. My nerves were everywhere. Having been evacuated to the basement, Shayla's husband Jerome made his way upstairs through the debris, not knowing if his wife and unborn child were alive. When I walked through those doors and I saw her, I was just, I was elated. And I see this big gaping hole in the wall and then that's when it hit me, it's like, wow, they all could have been gone. Jerome helped carry Shayla through the debris to an ambulance. Three hours after arriving here at the Norman Healthplex, Braden Emanuel was born. Emanuel actually means God is with us. And that's exactly how we felt in, that, in the midst of that situation. I have a healthy baby. My family's all still here. You know, I actually gained, in its instance, a family and the nurses that were there with me.